Super Crit here with a Kickstarter preview today of a brand new card game called Bayman, a cage card game that is entirely based on the roles of one of the finest actors of our generation, Sir Nicolas Cage. I think he was knighted, <laughs> right? Probably. In one uh, of his movies, at least. <laughs> in at least one of his movies. So named after his character from Season of the Witch, b beloved, universally beloved film, uh, this is a game very, very similar to Old Maid. You are, everybody has a hand of cards and you are passing one to the player on your left and going around and if you get a pair, then you put that pair in front of you. Of course, all of the cards, however, are different roles from Nicolas Cage movies. There's only one pair out there, so there's no weird odd things out. Once all the B-daddies are down, they're all down. Right. <laughs> yeah, so you can see you've got, like, you got your kick-ass here, Raising Arizona, The Wicker Man. I mean, that's <laughs> one of my personal favorites. Um, Ghost Rider. Yeah, Ghost Rider, a real, a real, a real classic. And, and there's the Bayman right there. Yes, if you have the Bayman, it's not good. Yeah, he does not have any other pair. There's only one. So, last one holding the Bayman is the loser. Yeah, so once all the pairs are out, you see who has the Bayman, and that's what it is. So, kind of like a game of Hot Potato, kind of like a game of Old Maid, pretty similar. So, this is super, super duper simple. That is all there is to it. It is a very light party game. You're really playing this for the Nick Cage aspect of it. That's pretty much it. <laughs> and you're you're looking at all the artwork and the funny depictions of the different Nicolas Cage roles. Uh, and I did I did find that uh, pretty fun because uh, there are some that I actually really like uh, and some Nicolas Cage movies that are actually really great. And I was like, oh, it's cool that they included that. Like The Weatherman is one that I actually think is really underrated. And, some, and there's a lot of movies that I hadn't seen. I didn't know what it was. Uh, and so it was like, oh, I wonder what that's from. Um, kind of made me want to go uh, at, at my own risk, look up and watch Nicolas Cage movie. There's adaptation. Uh, let's see how, how many how many do I know? There's Face Off, uh, and some I just don't I don't know what Frank is from. I don't uh, some of them yeah. I don't know. I definitely if you're more of a whether you just love Nicolas Cage or even a movie buff in general, this is definitely probably gonna you're gonna enjoy a bit more. But uh, I don't know as many movies. <laughs> I know maybe like three of them from this deck. <laughs> Yeah. So it's sort of otherwise it's 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 old maid. So don't come here for a game. <laughs> yeah. Come here to just laugh about Nicolas Cage, which <laughs> that in and of itself may be good enough for you. Truly, it's you know it, it is as you said. Don't come looking for a game. But I feel like I I, I can't fault it for not being a, a deep game. The same way I don't fault a big, Nicolas Cage. <laughs> the same way I don't fault a, a Big Mac for not being a salad. It's it's. This really this is a game that is trying to be uh it's for someone in your life who loves Nicolas Cage who has a fun and it's, it's like a great kind of I think stocking stuff or like a gag gift yeah and I will say the I do love the characters from him each even though though like I don't know some I do recognize it and I do think the art is it is funny Oh yeah, no, it's nice. It's it's really nice. Uh, definitely something that you could do while you play. I mean, they don't uh, have any kind of like house rules or variants that I saw, but it's the kind of thing where I don't know. You could you could do some impressions of the characters. You could try to answer trivia about him or something. Maybe you can only score if you can name the movie it's from. <laughs> yeah, there could be different things. You know, sort of like a deck of playing cards. You could make up your own uh, Nicolas Cage game. Yeah, they do like. come in four colors, which, as far as I know, they're just for looks. So yeah. I'm sure you can come up with stuff. But yeah, in the end. Uh, you're going to have to come up with your own stuff if you're really looking for a game. Otherwise, this is just for laughs in cages. It's for uh, hardcore Nicolas Cage fans only. Uh, uh, Bayman is the name of the game. Uh, it's not too expensive, like we said. It looks nice. It's funny. It's, it's kind of something funny to have on your shelf if you're a Cage fan. Uh, let us know in the comments if you're interested in Bayman. I'd love to hear what your favorite Nicolas Cage role or movie is. Uh, you can do that right down in the comments below. Uh, otherwise, this is on Kickstarter right now. We've got a link in the description so you can see it for yourself. I'm Jonathan. And if you pay attention, there's a secret message where we hid the Declaration of Independence. <laughs> oh, nice. Good deep cut reference. What's your name, though? <laughs> You'll have to find out by looking at the four-minute mark. <laughs> okay. And uh, this has been a Roll for Crit Kickstarter preview. Hey, if you like what you saw, don't forget to subscribe and like this video for more excellent board game content. Heck yeah.